I bet you wanted me to play all 12,000 repeats. Sorry, not doing it. Learn it yourself. Alrighty, so, um, the song kind of bases all around these first four bars. So if you learn these four first four bars, if you learn how to talk, first four bars, then you'll be fine. So let me show you that stuff. Um, first of all, this is a good left hand one. Our G chord and our D7 chord. So you drop your pinky down to the F sharp. that a couple times in your left hand because that's a lot of your parts. So you see your G chord here, see it all over the place, and there's that, G, that D7 chord, and then there's another version of it. So we're going to use that a lot. So if you can't play that too well, you can't play that song too well, I can't help you too much. So here's your, um, here's your first phrase that you really have to work out. You have these crossovers in the beginning, and then another crossover. Just be really careful of the rhythm on those two things, alright? Play it again. And move to C. Crossover. If you can get that, the song shouldn't be too hard. So one other part to the song. Um, for the first page and a half, it just does variations of that. It's nothing really hard, just like little twists, like this stuff. Um, but at measure 24, we have a major twist, that five golden ring. Five golden rings is a G chord to an A chord. G major in the left hand, A major in the right hand. And then this is a D chord where you have to move your thumb down to F sharp. So take a look at these three chords. Okay, so see my right hand thumb goes to F sharp. And then the rest of it's kind of easy one handed things. Right here is a big skip. Make sure you get down to E, not F. And then here we go. Four, three, two, one, one. Alright? And that part has an F sharp in it. So if you learn those two major sections, 12 days of Christmas will be yours. Don't sing it though, everybody will be very annoyed at you. Alright, bye.